at you. Thunder goes seven to two. Second jewel of the triple crown. All three year olds. All set. Oh, now the one. Itron is down in the gate. Jockey's off. Ricky Frazier seems to be standing behind the gate. Itron is in. Ready for the start again. And they're off. Talking man away quickly and cleanly. Thunder Gulch on the outside. Star Standard from between horses. As expected, Star Standard now takes command. And on the inside, Mystery Storm with Craig Perrette showing a little early speed. And Talking Man gathered back there in tight quarters. Now third and away from the rail. Thunder Gulch, the Derby winner, is fourth on the outside. Then comes Oliver's Twist, saving ground along the inside rail. The favored Timber Country is next. Itron is next along the inside, followed by Tejano Run. Panabras is second, is third last on the outside, Mecky. And far, far back, our Gatsby is about 25 lengths from the leader. And the leader is Mystery Storm along the inside, showing the way by ahead, being pressed on the outside by Star Standard. And now Talking Man gains ground three out from the rail in third. Oliver's Twist at the rail and Checkered Colors races fourth. The Derby winner with Gary Stevens. Thunder Gulch on the outside is fifth at this point, about six lengths from the lead. Then the favorite, Timber Country along the inside is next. Then comes Tejano Run, and I think Jerry Bailey's pushing on him and asking for some speed, but he's not getting it. Mecky along the inside gains, followed by Panna Brass. Itron is out of it, as is our Gatsby. They move to the top of the stretch. Now Star Standard takes the lead. On the inside, Mystery Storm. Talking Man on the outside is right there. Oliver's Twist looks for some racing room. Thunder Gulch is also in traffic. And on the outside, here comes Timber Country. And down the stretch they come in the Preakness. Pat Day with Timber Country on the outside. Thunder Gulch toward the inside is second. Along the inside, Oliver's Twist is third. Through the stretch and to the wire, Timber Country has the lead. Oliver's Twist on the inside will get the runner up spot. And the Derby winner, Thunder Gulch, finished third. What an exciting Preakness as Timber Country came to the top of the stretch. Wayne Luke has predicted this as the two-year-old champ from last year finally wins a race in 1995, passing Oliver's Troy Twist on the inside, who came up strongly. The Maryland bred, the only Maryland bred, was the second spot, and Thunder Gulch finished third. The fourth Preakness victory for Pat Day. Unofficially, it's Timber Country in one minute, 54 and two-fifths seconds. That's one second off the stakes record. November. It's been more than six months, but he wins today, goes off as the 9-5 to five favorite in Timber Country in a result that is now official. Pays 580, 420, and 280. Oliver's twist, who was bet down early and then got no action late, turned in a beautiful performance to finish second, 1680 and 640. And Thunder Gulch, the other Lucas horse, the winner of the Kentucky Derby, pays 360. Oliver's Twist went off at 18 to 1. Thunder Gulch was the third choice, $266 for the exacta. 